This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. So! What are we doing? It must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the Blight. Both, actually. But, um... I should... Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you. No matter what, you're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Okay, but if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> A focus. Never thought I'd get your second sight. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. You see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. Shall we? Scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. So it's time for your first lesson with the focus. Sounds good. Let's get started. These plants don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. The focus helps you see the ones we need. Down this way. Get to the cross. Never seen one of those before. Me neither. Oh, 
Those dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. I know. It was kind of awesome. You're not gonna kill me, are you? I haven't seen you, and I don't even know how long. 45 days. Well, 46, technically. Want to know what I've been up to? All this time, I thought you were dead. Yeah. Here. Look. No way. Still no roommate? I had to sleep under Liz for three years, and you know how bad that girl smelled. You're a firefly. <laughs> you still have it up. What? What are you doing? I'm making sure I don't get caught with a firefly in my room. Relax. There are no soldiers on the entire floor. Here, congrats. Hey. Are we cool? Are we cool? I disappeared and you're mad. Yeah. And I owe you an explanation. Let's get out of here and I'll tell you all about it. It's almost morning, and I have military drills. You know, where we learn how to kill fireflies. Put some pants on and let's go. <sighs> I'm so dumb. Oh, come on. When have we ever gotten into trouble? <sighs> Shit. Come on, give me some. Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna put you on your side. <coughs> Jesus. Something to stitch you up, okay? Callus, keep an eye on him. I'll be back in a flash. Promise. Now, there we go. It'll be faster to go through here. Man. What? Nothing, it's just... I've never seen anything like this, that's all. You mean the woods? Yeah. Never walked in the woods. It's kind of cool. <laughs> why don't you just take me back to Marlene? If she was up to the task, why'd she drop you off on us? Well, maybe she's better now. Kid, I don't mean to upset you, but your friend's chances of survival weren't too high to begin with. She's a lot tougher than you think. It don't matter. Because I doubt I can get either one of us back into the city in one piece. Trust me. 
I wish there were some other option. My master, <laughs> safe. The scriptures, sound. All I ever wanted was a life in my mountain, free from you and your so-called merits. Those high above don't trust me. I understand that. And they send you and those knuckleheads to threaten me. To obey and serve once more. <laughs> I understand that too. But what I don't understand is... You bastards killing my kind! Just any monkey. He's a monkey of merit. A monkey was made Buddha once. None other than me can challenge him to a duel. Look, monkey. I don't make a habit of fighting someone I've bested before. Here's my offer. If you lose, I'll take you to the Celestial Court. They will stay and level your mountain. But if I lose, I shall certainly take revenge, and they will level your mountain nonetheless. Hmm. How tragic would that be, huh? You are one of the court. We don't need to resort to violence. How about you bend the knees, admit the wrongs, and we can put this behind us? <laughs> All these years, except for that pig, you're the one who talks the tallest tales. Good, I am entertained. Speaking of entertainment, wouldn't it be fun if I pluck your extra eye out for my snack and allow you to keep the other two? Because I'd hate to let you miss how I'll slaughter each mongrel of the court. Those below, those above, and that black mutt of yours. Come at me, all of you. Fighting Buddha. Have you any idea how many would give their everything for immortality? Immortality? <laughs> for that word, 
All realms and beings have ruined themselves. is invading our home. They are brutal. Relentless. Unstoppable. We are 80 Samurai against an army fighting to slow the invasion. Today, I die for my people. There must be thousands of them. We will face death and defend our home. Tradition. Courage. Honor. They are what make us. We are the warriors of Tsushima. We are samurai! Dadachi, go break their spirits. Outsiders, send your finest warrior to face me. Nada, Jinnida. I am Haru Nobu Adachi, descendant of the legendary Yoshi Nobu Adachi. Lord Sakai, even if it cost us our lives. Men, 
We must hunt down the Mongol leader. Everyone, with me!